Hi, I'm Wolf from MeshCloud, and in this video, I'm going to show you three easy ways to delete an AWS account. We are going to delete an account that I created for a little text-to-speech uh, project I had. I used Amazon's Poly service for a video to explain how to create a cloud project within MeshStack. Um, check it out in the description if you want to see how that turned out. But we want to delete. So I'll show you three ways how you can close your AWS account using the web interface, the command line, or the API. For all of them, you will need to have admin access to the so-called root account. The root account hosts all the individual member accounts. So make sure you have that admin access to the root account. Let's start with deleting the AWS account using the web interface. Just head to the top right corner and click Organization. There, you'll get a list of all the AWS accounts within your organization. Just search for the one you want to delete, like Poly text-to-speech uh, in our case here. Click it, and you're presented these three options. Remove, move, and close. Remove removes the account from the organization. It doesn't delete it. Move just lets you move the account within your organization and close is the actual deletion button. So we want to click that one. You're presented this prompt. Just check the check marks and enter your ID. That's all you have to do. Click close account and your account will be closed. So now let's use the command line to delete your AWS account. Head over to your favorite command line. Of course, you have to have the AWS command line tool installed and configured. You can get a list of your accounts, just, we saw, uh, just as we saw on the uh, web interface, by typing AWS organizations list accounts. This will generate a list of your accounts. You can see the one that we want to delete here as number one account and uh, we'll need the account ID for deleting it. For the actual deletion process, uh, you go with AWS organizations, close account, account ID, and then enter the value for the ID. You hit enter. If we now head over back to the web interface, and click on organization and search for our uh, account again, Holly. we can see that it says suspended. That means that the uh, command line um, work we did worked and the account will eventually be deleted. So now let's use the API and Postman to delete our AWS account. But you know what? Let's not do that. It turns out it's insanely complicated and too long for this video. Um, I clicked on the documentation. It has to do with signature version four. Like, how does it work? Tons of stuff you have to do to actually to get it work in uh, Postman. So we're not going to do that. I'll cover that in a different video. But let me say with MeshStack, we offer a platform that takes care of a smooth deletion process for all clouds, Azure, GCP, AWS, you name it. So if you don't use MeshStack, that's too bad, but you can go with the web interface or the CLI for AWS and you'll be just fine. So thank you for watching this video and take care.